Franz Xaver Winterhalter was a German painter and lithographer, born on April 20, 1805 in Menzenschwand, Germany, who lived until July 8, 1873. Winterhalter worked in the two art movements of Neoclassicism and Romanticism. His preferred genre was portrait painting, and he was especially skilled at portraying the royalty of his time. Winterhalter's style was a blend of highly detailed realism with some romanticism, featuring grand compositions and vivid colors. His portraits of Empress Eugenie surrounded by her ladies-in-waiting, 1855, and Empress Elizabeth of Austria, 1865, are some of his most famous works. Winterhalter was a talented artist who was greatly influenced by the cultural and intellectual movements of his time. He was friends with some of the most important people of his era, including the Duke of Wellington and the Chancellor of Germany. Winterhalter was also part of an important school of painting in France and enjoyed great success during his lifetime. Born into a family of farmers and resin producers, Franz Xaver Winterhalter began his artistic education at a young age. At 18, he capitalized on a stipend and began studying at the Academy of Arts in Munich under the likes of Peter von Cornelius and furthering his understanding of drawing and engraving. The talented draftsman and lithographer found a more sponsor in Joseph Steeler and began entering court circles when he became the drawing master to Sophie Margravine of Baden in 1828. Winterhalter soon began establishing himself as an artist beyond southern Germany, utilizing his talent to travel to Italy in the early 1830s. It was in France when Winterhalter's style flourished, catching the eyes of the country's most elite. His Italian genre scene Illinois Dolce Farniente and Portrait of the Prince of Wagram with his daughter were both highly esteemed compositions in the style of Raphael, demonstrating Winterhalter's ability to find inspiration in classical fundamentals. His career as a portrait painter took off in 1838, after he painted Louise Marie of Orleans, Queen of the Belgians, along with her son. It was this painting that led to Winterhalter catching the attention of Maria Amalia of the Two Sicilies, Queen of the French and mother of the Queen of the Belgians. Winterhalter's talent soon caught the eye of other renowned figures, and he would paint portraits of some of the biggest names of his time, from Louis Philippe, King of France, to Empress Eugenie, capturing their elegance in lifelike detail. As Winterhalter matured as an artist, he continued making stunning contributions to portraiture throughout his life. He was a painter to the Grand Ducal Court and remained close to his family throughout his life, mainly to his brother Hermann, who was also a painter. Winterhalter's most famous works, Empress Elizabeth of Austria in Dancing Dress and the Royal Family in 1846, perfectly encapsulate his aptitude in capturing their grandeur with a single brushstroke. He continued to accept commissions up until his death at the age of 68, with works such as the portrait equester de François Adolphe Ackermann living on as a testament to his style and legacy. In conclusion, Franz Xaver Winterhalter was a German painter who gained great recognition during his time for his ability to capture the elegance of royalty in his portrait paintings. His style was a fusion of neoclassicism and romanticism, showcasing grand compositions and vibrant colors. Winterhalter's success and fame grew as he became a painter to the Grand Ducal Court and was friends with some of the most influential people of his era. Despite his humble beginnings, Winterhalter's talent was acknowledged by some of the biggest names of his time, including Empress Eugenie and Louis Philippe, King of France. His most famous works, including the portraits of Empress Elizabeth of Austria and the royal family, embody Winterhalter's lifelike detail and unique style. Winterhalter's enduring legacy in the art world remains a testament to his exemplary artistic vision and talent.